Hi, beautiful. You look stunning. Thank you for being here today. We're watching some people chop off their extremely long hair. People cutting their extremely long hair short is so satisfying. Like there's something about it that just gives me all the energy I need for the day. And watching it fall to the ground brings a smile to my face. It's also the transformation that happens when you're cutting really long hair short. The person transforms into a whole another being and it's so exciting to watch. So let's watch some people cut their very long hair much shorter. Let's do it. Up first, we have a video by Miss Mina, and this is called Cutting My Hair Up to 17 Inches. That's a lot of inches, Miss Ma'am. I'm cutting my hair really short. I can't Actually, wait. I've been growing it out during these COVID times because I'm going to donate it. Make sure if you're cutting a lot of length off your hair, please donate it. All it takes is just putting your hair in a tie and cutting it off and you just send it away. It's so easy and it helps so many people. So make sure you donate your hair, please. You can also have your hair stylist do this for you, but I just really wanted to cut it myself. I'm a DIY kind of gal. Yo, her hair is so long and so From beautiful. The tip, that is, that's a Oh, she's going short, short. Ooh, let's add yes, that. Yes, yes, yes. How did this? Yes, yes. Give it to us. Oh, plus huh. five. 17 inches. That is like up to here. That's going to be a huge difference. I adjusted all of these so that it's equal. And now we're going to start braiding them. I also saw people just um, put rubber band here to secure the hair. It kind of looks like- What in the f is this? <laughs> She's giving me like avant-garde, like Paris Fashion Week haute couture. Like I kind of love this look. Yeah, I'm definitely living for this. I have two scissors here oh, from the kitchen. Great. Certain situations, this scissor does a better job. Other situations, this one. We had to pull out the kitchen scissors, didn't we? We couldn't just get some hair cutting scissors. Like no, it, that'll just never happen, I guess. <laughs> what the f Not a big deal. You could grow it out again. <sighs> Oh my god, she hasn't had her hair this short in 20 years. It's a lot of years, girl. And we're about to cut that shit off, and it's going to be a huge difference. I feel like I'm definitely going to love it. Here it goes, the big chop. Oh, oh. It's happening. Yo, she really went for it. Yeah. Oh my god, that's very short. Wow, it's really soft. Those ends are just cut off soft. 17 inches. Of course it's gonna be soft. The ends of my hair is not soft. I mean, eventually this will not be soft anymore, but this feels so nice. I can't stop touching it. Yo, she went from zero to 60, baby. And I love it. I appreciate her. I love this girl. The haircut's gonna be very jagged and crazy though. I must admit, I know this is not gonna look very great. That's my hair. Whoa. The second section is over 12 inches. Yo, her hair was so long. Mommy, I was gonna help cut the back one. How do you do the camera? Hold on, hold on. I hope we're getting this fixed because what is that? Can we do a zoom in of that side panel? Why does it go from here to here? What is this chopping action we have going on? Why does it look like that? It's horrifying. You're scaring me, girl. Girl, what's going on on the side there? Now, can you do this back one here? I love mom. Yes! Keep chopping, keep chopping. I, but also, make it look better somehow. Please. <laughs> I feel like I've been cutting for a while. What's happening? Maybe this section has the most amount of hair. Why am I still cutting? Okay, there we go. Last piece. Yes, we did it. She probably feels so much relief. Oh, I love those cute little pieces we have going on. Keep it like this. You sh she should keep it like that. <laughs> I love Seriously, it. Seriously, what if I kept these in It's kind of a vibe. As fun as these are, let's cut it off. Girl, are we not worried about the actual haircut? Like, are I'm we not a, concerned yeah, about what's going on here. in this haircut right now? Cause I am. Oh, it feels weird. It feels so short. I cut off so much hair, my head feels light. I love the shorter hair on her. It's such a vibe. However, I want to know what we're doing with the haircut, and I want to know now. One of the things I'm looking forward to is taking less time to dry my hair. And I'm going to use less water, less shampoo, less conditioner. So... <laughs> Sorry. Sadly enough, the video ended there. I don't know what happened to her hair after that, but I just hope it wasn't left like that. So I'm gonna look through her channel really quick and just figure out what's going on here. The cone is sweeter than the ice cream. Mm-hmm. 
and it's a very subtle sweep. Mm. It looks to me like she got a real haircut and it's now fixed. Thank you, hair gods. Thank you for not letting her leave her hair like that. I would have had to go over there and save her. <laughs> Thank you. It was tragic. It was scary. I love a crop bob. Like, I just think they're so chic and so cute and like fresh and fun. It makes you look super stylish. Like, I just love the vibe. I love seeing the transformation on her and I love how it came out. Congratulations, girl. Next up, we have a video by Lauren Eloise and this is called Chopping My Hair Off. How many hand lengths is my hair? Like yep. this? Yep. Dude, her hair is so long. Holy sh. Oh my god. Seven, that eight, is nine, a ten, ten a little bit. Yo, she's about to chop all of this hair off. I literally can't believe it. A lot of people's hair do, don't does not get to that length. Like that is some serious, serious length. And she's about to go chop, chop, charu. Oh my god! Holy sh! Dude. What? This is crazy. I want to see it go though. I want to see it chopped off. Could you imagine having to deal with that hair? Like having to wash it, dry it, style it, brushing it, combing. Just, it's so much work. Imagine trying to color that hair, how much color it would take, how expensive it is, how much shampoo and conditioner you need. It is way too much for me to wrap my head around and I could not and could never and would never. Never say never, but you know. Get half of it. Here is about where it's going to be cut, right? Okay, so she's still keeping it longer. Her short is our like, extremely long. She's still getting rid of a considerable amount of hair, like a lot of hair. That's like an entire head of hair that she's cutting off and it's still extremely long. That is so crazy. That's definitely more than 35. Have you measured that? I'm about to. Let's do that now. <laughs> He's a tech measure I prepared earlier. I can't even believe how long her hair is. It's 45 centimeters. I am so not ready to do this. Yo, she's freaking out. She's like, I don't know if I should do this or not. I don't know if this is the best idea. I can only imagine being her. Like, that's a lot of hair to get rid of. When you have hair that length, like, it becomes, like, a safety blanket for a lot of people. So I get it why it's such a big deal to cut that hair off. I could only imagine. Oh, this is weird. We're using kitchen scissors, of course, but we're doing it. She's going for it, girl. I can feel the anxiety coming from her through the screen right now. I don't like this. <laughs> There's no going back now. You already did it. It's too thick. We did it too thick. Oh my god, look at all that hair she cut off. I don't know, it's weird. It feels weird. <laughs> it's like I'm holding it, like my arm is being cut off. <laughs> like your arm's being cut off. It's weird. She's freaking out. I don't blame her, I really don't. This looks so much better already though. Like these are the vibes and she should definitely do some cool color to her hair after this. This one's a bit more enjoyable. <laughs> Look at all that hair getting cut. Wow. That is it's, it's, I can't get over this feeling of this not being attached to me. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. Like, it literally feels like a cough. Ugh. It is kind of creepy. It's like a dead animal. It's a little, a lot of bit uneven. There's only like one bit down here that's a bit long that I can fix for you, but it's actually pretty good. The thickness of her hair now is incredible. Literally like that thick. Like she has such gorgeous hair. Ah, it's weird. I don't know. <laughs> She's freaking out. Really, really, really good. It looks way better. Hey, I kind of really like it. Yay! We like it. That was awesome. I definitely feel as though she needs some layering in there. You know, just a real haircut. You know, give it some texture. Give it something more going on than like one length. You know, just anything. I'll take anything. And maybe even some color, like some highlights, just to brighten things up. You already made this huge leap. Why don't you do something a little extra? But hey, that's just me. And that's coming from a kid with red hair. So what the f do I know? I constantly change my hair. So I don't, I don't know what it's like to not do it. I think you look beautiful and you look beautiful now. And I love the haircut. I love that big chop and congratulations. Up next, we have a video by Danny No. Danny No, we know. No, no, no. I don't know how to say it, but this is called I cut my hair and failed badly. LOL. Postpartum hair loss. Got my hair straightener. We're gonna start with straightening my hair. Okay. I'm actually going to be following the Brad Mondo hair tutorial. As you can see, I have a lot of hair. Great. People following my 
when I have to watch it, it's like scary. I'm confident, but then when I see everybody doing things, I get scared. Like I just want it to come out good so badly. It makes me nervous, so. It's going to be so scary. Another thing, I oh my God. Frizzy hair ever in my life. And now it is so frizzy. Like That is a lot of hair. That's a main baby girl. Yeah, if um Brad Mondo ever sees this video, I hope this turns out good. Me too. I don't know how short, like what am I thinking? Girl, it's a blanket, a comforter over your body. I hate my hair short, so what am I thinking? I don't know. I'm just gonna straighten my hair. I'm so happy she's straightening it to start because it's either you wet it guys or you straighten it. Very, very pin straight or else your hair is not gonna come out correctly. The lines are gonna be all jagged and gross. This is like where my breakage is. Like my hair Ooh, is broken off. Yeah. All right, so my hair is straight. That was the first step, but I'm gonna probably go a little bit below my shoulder. <sighs> what am I doing? Oh, we are going short. Okay, for a girl who doesn't like her hair short, you're definitely doing it. You're definitely going really short. I know I don't have the little elastics. I hope this is still gonna be okay. What if I cut it that short? I think I would cry. And the sad thing is my hair doesn't even look dead anymore now that I'm doing this, but I think that's just myself telling me to not do this. All right, this is a good length, but it looks okay. What am I doing? Okay, I love that she's not over directing the hair forward. That way she gets a nice clean line in the back and things aren't all like whoop and crazy and she's not over directing the hair. That way she gets longer hair in the back. This is great. Whoever taught you how to do this is a genius. Like, I'm sorry. Did I say that this is the biggest mistake in my life? Did I? No, it's not. I feel so good go about this. Let's do it, let's do it, oh let's God, do it. Oh, oh. What? Yo, she went for it real quick. I'm losing my mind. I'm pretty sure this is postpartum for me. Holy sh Yes, yes, this has yes. This to do with postpartum. Oh my God, I'm so excited for her. Doing it. I already hate it, but whatever. You hate it? <laughs> you hate it? It looks awesome. Now we're thinning out the hair a bit before so we take this. the ponytails off. Choppy, but what can you do? I already started. Okay, my point cutting skills are trash. Yeah. What? Yeah, I'm probably not the going cutest. To be wearing my hair in a ponytail for the rest of my life. It's okay. Oh <gasps> no, I did not just cut my rubber band. No, 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 no. Why did I do this? Why? Okay, now I'm not even doing this right. Yeah, you're freaking out. No, Coda, your mommy went crazy. <laughs> We're just gonna hope I don't cut any other hair ties. Alright, just don't cut the hair tie, please. Okay, this side's even harder. This is making me nervous. I'm glad she's thinning it out a bit because her hair is extremely dense and thick and if she doesn't, it's going to be so blunt. I honestly, I was gonna do layers and stuff, but I don't know. Come on! I've been this short since I was like 12. You gotta I do the layers. Ignoring this piece because I'm just so nervous. Like, should we just not continue? It actually looks really good. Like, you did a great job. Oh! Oh my God. Do I dare to try layers? I've gone this far, should I do it? First off, let me just look at the back of my head. Let's see it. Oh, yeah, it is uneven. Pretty bad. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I feel like I failed you with this. Something went wrong. I'm putting that on you, okay? What did I do? I was excited for a second. One side looks good, the other side not so much. This is it. I'm probably going to stop the video here. I just know I cannot finish. I feel like me cutting off the rubber band gave me anxiety and I just couldn't like complete it. My hair has needed to be just like cut just so it's healthy and everything. So I'm not mad at it. I love the haircut. Um, it's not perfect. We can fix that though. And you definitely need some layering, girl. Come on, get those layers in there. Your hair is so puffy and like thick. You need to get some movement in there. It'll look so good and it'll help refresh those ends even more. So I definitely recommend doing that and maybe even doing a color. An next Mondo color, color? A red, a purple, a blue, a green, an orange, a yellow, a red. I say go for it, you know? And that's just me. Those were some major chops. They really went for it and it came out amazing. I am so happy for you girls in this video for doing that and just taking a leap of faith, chopping all that hair off. It probably makes you feel so brand new. I just hope you're living your extra life is really all I ever hoped for. I know it could be scary to do that, so I give you the props. I mean, the cutting was not the best, but we'll ignore that. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you do right down below. Click that subscribe button, please.
Hees. You can also click the like button and the bell icon to be notified every time I post a new video. Make sure you follow me everywhere else. Bing, bing, boom, bing, boom, ba, ga, ka, ba, ba, ka, 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 ba, all around me. This is my number. If you guys would like to text me, yes, it's really connected to my phone. And yes, I do see some of your messages. So text me now and I'll be responding back to a few of you guys. Also, this will keep you notified every time I post a new video. Make sure you check out my hair care and my hair color line at xmodelhair.com. It is linked below for you. You can also head to our Instagram for some hair inspiration. If you want color inspiration, you can go to X Mondo Color. And if you want hair care inspiration, you can go to X Mondo Hair on Instagram. My hair color right now is super orange and super red mixed together to create this wonderful, magical, really bright red. If you'd like to live your extra life with me, check out my merch now. It is adorable. I wear it every single day of my life. It is so comfy. I live in this. Check it out at xmonohair.com or at link below for you. Today's Instagram shout out goes to Lana and she says, Hi Brad, I wanted to do a color and hairstyle change for the summer, but I'm not exactly sure what color to do. Please give me some advice on what color and style you think would suit me. I can do that for you. I can definitely do that. This is so lame, but my first reaction is that I love your hair. I'm sure you want to change, but it looks good. I think doing a middle part, doing some curtain bangs, if anything, lightening the hair a little bit, doing some balayage highlights, just something around the face, um, and towards the ends of the hair. Something very natural looking would look great on you, but I love the haircut and I love the way you style it. So I think you should keep that the way it is. That's all for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.